Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. The push button can be added to a form if you want to have more than just simple submit and reset buttons that are automatically inserted into the form for you. These buttons can be used in the normal submit and reset fashions but can also be used with custom scripts that you might create. In this dialog box, you can give the button a name, a value or label, select a button type, and a tab order. The name and the tab order work the same way here as they do with other fields. The value or label is the text you want to display on the button. For the button type, select normal if you will be creating your own script for how the button should behave. Select submit if you want it to simply send the information from the form to a form handler and select Reset if you want it to clear all of the fields in the form. Front Page 2002 and 2003 also have something called an Advanced button which, that is a lot like the Push button. However, when you insert an Advanced button, you must fully customize it yourself and it does not even have a border or even a button label yet. When you're finished with your options here, click OK. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachyoucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high-quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy-to-use training package. With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!